So I love toasting and I love bringing that spirit to any occasion. Part of it is I really consider it like a superpower, okay? <laughs> so, so much of it is really looking forward to who's coming to my table, thinking about what they mean to me, thinking about what I wish for them, and I'm really in that space even before they arrive. Ukrainian toasting is about coming from the heart. It's about who is that person for you? What do you wish for them? And so much of it is this honoring of people in a community place. So it happens around a table, around special occasions, but it doesn't have to be a special occasion. Toasting isn't just cheers to you on your birthday. It's reaching for the fences, like, you know, swinging for the fences. If you don't make that person cry or deeply moved or something, or everybody in the room, then you've not gone far enough. So it's really amazing. It, it creates a feeling in the evening that you just don't get otherwise. And then there's a whole order to it. You know, the first toast, uh, it's from, you know, from the host welcoming the guests. The second toast is from one of the guests thanking the host. And then the third toast is always to women. And then four, five, and six are a free for all. Seven, back to the women again. And then from there on in, it's anything goes. Season, health, prosperity, continuous learning and growth, because that's what we're all about. And may all of your dreams come true. Here's Cheers. to us. Cheers. To us. To us. Yay. 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 John adopted the Ukrainian traditions after joining Catherine's family. He shares this sage advice. I learned this about three parties too late, is you don't have to drink the whole shot every toast. Because, and, and, and whatever you do, don't drink at all unless there's a toast because there will be lots of them. And people will look at you funny. If you start drinking in between toasts, they're like, why is that person drinking? We're going to have another toast soon, you know. And, and, and the only time you have to drink the whole shot is if you're the one making the toast or if the toast is being made to you. The rest of the time you can just go like... I would like to toast the extraordinary women in our lives, and in particular the four here in this room, who are sisters, mothers. This year is an excellent time to adopt this tradition, showing appreciation for those we haven't been able to see over the last year, and getting to know who they've become. Each and every one of you has your own unique way of doing all of those things, and I just want to recognize all of you for being extraordinary to you. With Christmas coming, it's such a great opportunity to really look at the people around our table with new eyes. Who are they for you? What do you wish for them? And really coming from a generous, open spirit. For Halton News, Woodmore. I'm Nikki Wesley. Cheers to you and yours. Mm, so good. Oh my goodness. So good. Thank mm. you, John. <laughs> wow.